Okay, so I decided to go really far outside my comfort zone with eyeshadow colors and try something completely new. So let's see if this works out. I hope it does. But I had these colors and I saw them and I thought, oh my gosh, they're so crazy. And I wanted to show you a really easy way to put on eyeshadow. So what I have here is Sedona, Valencia, and um, oh, Atlantic. Why am I... I, it's so funny when you know something, but you just have to look it up anyway. Atlantic. Okay, and I'm going to show you a technique on putting it on. And I have the, blush, uh, the brush cleaning, cleaning tile because the colors are so different that I don't want them to mix. Okay, so this eyeshadow brush, I'm going to take the smaller end, not the fluffy end that I do the blending, but the smaller end. And I'm going to go um, from the outer portion of my eye in based on color, and I'm just gonna make vertical lines. So I'm gonna pick the darkest color first, and I'm just gonna do a vertical line. Scary, right? You'll see how this works. Vertical line, okay? Again, I don't want them mixing, so I'm gonna clean my brush, okay? Super easy to clean my brush. Then I'm gonna go to the next darkest color, and you can do this with any of them. Don't worry about that fallout. It's cream-based makeup. So all I got to do is swipe it away. It does not make a difference. Put a little more. Crazy, right? So crazy. And then I'm going to clean my tile and it's really coming off. And then I'm going to pick this crazy color, right, which is a shimmer. And I'm going to put it on the inside. All right. We'll put it on the inside. All right. Sometimes it's easier, I find, with these shimmers to put it on with your finger. See that? Oh, wow. Look at that. Okay, this is not a color combination I would normally use. Then I take the fluffy end and I am going to let the brush do all the work. I want to come up a little so I can still see it when I open my eyes. And it just keeps all the colors. Do the other side. Don't worry about fixing it. I'm wearing cream-based makeup, and all I have to do is swipe it away. And you do it until it's mixed to the point that you want it. Okay. I'm going to take my brush, and I'm going to just swoop it away. And you won't even know. Just swoop it away. What I usually like to do is I like to put the pop of the color at the top here. And I usually use cupcake for that. Just the same color no matter what I put on. It's just because it makes it a little lighter. I'm going to clean that up a little. Look at that. Look at how easy that is. And I'm going to clean up a little more. Look at how easy that is. Look at that. Very pretty, interesting colors. Little pop of the shimmer of a color that I normally don't use. Now that Atlantic, that Atlantic is just a little, it's a very soft, you can't even really tell it's there. If you want it to make it a stronger green, okay? Okay, just a little. If you want it to make a stronger green color, we have setting spray. You just wet it a little bit and it, it just sticks on. It just makes it a more powerful green. But this is my makeup, very easy going. And you see, you can do that eyeshadow trick with any color. Start with the darkest and then go in to the lightest and the brush does all the work for you. You saw, you just make lines and you blend it in and that's it. Super easy 
really great technique. If you're not new, I was not big on, I never wore eyeshadow before Saint because I didn't know how to put it on. Super easy way to put it on.